the defile. We can't. That's it. Let's go. Are you still mad? About what? I mean, whenever you get mad, you seem to get possessed by Ratatosk. And you're that way, right now. Now that you mention it, I suppose I am. What can I do to make you forgive me? <laughs> Why worry about this wimp's feelings? Wimp? Are you talking about me? I'm talking about the normal me. He's a weak coward who takes his own insecurities out on you. He's worse than a dog. Don't talk about yourself like that! And sure, you might get scared sometimes, but you're one of the nicest people I've ever met. Marta! Uh, I mean, I'm not trying to force myself on you or anything. I, um... Yes, I know. I'm sorry, I just get so worked up sometimes. I know it's annoying. No, I shouldn't have said what I did. I'm sorry. Thank you. It's really foggy. We could easily get lost in this before we even find Paul. Hey, Paul! If you're out here, say something! I have a bad feeling about this. Courage is the magic that turns dreams into reality, right? <sighs> Courage is the magic that turns dreams into reality. Huh? Their words, a human with a few screws loose said long ago. I'm sure I'll see Richter again if we keep searching for the Centurion's course. He'll laugh at me if I'm still a coward. It's a little spooky, but let's keep moving forward. This fog is really thick. Yeah, and something doesn't feel right. something here really is it Paul it's just a tree sorry I could have sworn I heard something moving <laughs> a little jumpy are we well it's scary actually so is fighting look out you two ah! a monster Oh, Neil, I was so scared. You were more scary. What did you say? Nothing. It appears we can continue along this route. I wonder if Paul went this way too. Hirsuta is fairly mobile, so it is possible Paul went inside before it blocked this entrance. Emil, I'm so impressed! You sensed a monster that even Tenebrae didn't know was there. That was my mistake. It is quite embarrassing. But what you said is correct, Lady Marta. It seems that Emil's awakening is coming right along. Awakening? Awake to what? Awakening as a Knight of Ratatosk to protect Lady Marta. Tenebrae, enough of this Emil protecting me stuff, okay? Hmm. But being a Knight of Ratatosk means... He has to protect Ratatosk's core on my forehead. We'll do it together, right Emil? Yeah. It makes me kind of sad when she says that. Why?
Emile, is something wrong? You're looking rather sad. N no, I'm fine. It's just... Is Marta really okay with the way things are? I see. You miss hearing, I love you, Emile, all the time. That's not it at all. I just didn't know girls could change their minds so quickly. In other words, you want her to be more cuddly. No, just forget it. You really are a spiteful old nag, you know that? Spiteful old nag? So this is the human ranch. Don't worry, all the designs are gone now. Yeah. I guess I'll have to be the big manly knight that's protecting you. Hey, I can be manly. <laughs> Sorry. But just because you're a man doesn't mean that a girl can't protect you. Well, I guess not, but... Excuse me, you two, but what are we doing here again? Looking for Paul. Thank you. There doesn't seem to be any sign of young Paul. This place is way too dangerous for a child. We've got to find him fast. Yeah, I hope he's all right. Well, let's hurry up and start looking. We keep coming out in weird places. Well, this is the only way we can go since all of the main passages seem to be destroyed. There must have been a large-scale assault on this facility. The designs were taken down by the Chosen and her friends, right? Did Colette do all of this? She didn't look like the violent type. I bet Lloyd did it. It's hard to believe he's Colette's friend. Indeed, she seemed quite the peaceful sort. It's difficult to associate her with Lloyd, the gleeful mass murderer of the Blood Purge. Colette didn't seem to favor Tethaala. I wonder about Lloyd. It's pretty obvious that as far as he's concerned, anyone who's not Tethaala or part of the Church of Martell is nothing. <laughs>